The aerospace industry is on the brink of revolutionary advancements, with plasma-based propulsion systems poised to redefine the standards of engine technology. Plasma, often referred to as the fourth state of matter, plays a pivotal role in this transformation. It forms when sufficient energy is applied to gas, ionizing as particles and creating a highly energetic medium where electrons are separated from atoms. What makes plasma particularly useful is its susceptibility to manipulation through electric currents or magnetic fields. When heated to temperatures exceeding 100 million degrees Celsius, plasma can achieve fusion conditions. This opens up a range of possibilities from generating immense energy to advancing propulsion systems. Understanding plasma and its applications in propulsion. Plasma propulsion systems leverage the unique properties of plasma to generate thrust in innovative ways. Unlike traditional propulsion methods that rely on burning chemical fuels, plasma systems manipulate charged particles using electric and magnetic fields to create controlled propulsion. Techniques such as magnetic confinement, laser-driven heating, and Z-pinch technology are employed to achieve and maintain plasma in a high-energy state. Z-pinch, for instance, uses electrical currents to compress and heat plasma, achieving conditions necessary for propulsion. However, creating sustainable plasma conditions remains a challenge. The International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor, a $22 billion global fusion project, exemplifies the scale of effort required to harness plasma's power. Plasma propulsion systems promise not only cleaner and more efficient operations, but also the ability to reach previously unattainable speeds in space exploration. As global interest in sustainable technologies grows, the development of plasma-based propulsion systems represents a step toward reducing dependence on fossil fuels in the aerospace sector. Limitations and challenges of plasma propulsion systems Despite their potential, plasma propulsion systems face significant technical and practical challenges. One of the biggest hurdles is the development of compact and lightweight power sources with high energy densities. While current batteries have energy densities approximately 20 times lower than jet fuel, advancements in solid-state and lithium-air batteries are being explored to bridge this gap. Another challenge is the extreme heat generated during plasma propulsion, which necessitates advanced cooling systems and heat-resistant materials. For example, the heat-resistant ceramic matrix composites used in the NASA Space Shuttle could offer insights into designing components for plasma systems. Furthermore, the relatively low thrust levels of plasma systems, such as the 6 pounds of thrust per kilowatt seen in experimental microwave plasma thrusters, limit their immediate practicality for high-demand applications like commercial aviation. While turbogenerators such as Rolls-Royce's cutting-edge systems show promise, their heavy weight and reliance on additional fuel create logistical constraints. Addressing these challenges will require significant investment in material science, energy storage, and thermal management technologies. Fusion-based plasma drives, the future of space travel. The true game-changer in plasma propulsion lies in achieving fusion conditions within the propulsion system. Fusion, the process that powers the sun, involves combining atomic nuclei at extreme temperatures to release vast amounts of energy. When plasma reaches temperatures exceeding 100 million degrees Celsius, fusion conditions are possible. This breakthrough could revolutionize space travel, allowing spacecraft to achieve exceptional speeds while maintaining high fuel efficiency. Fusion-based plasma drives would deliver specific impulse values far surpassing those of chemical rockets. For instance, theoretical models suggest speeds exceeding 500,000 miles per hour, significantly reducing travel times for interplanetary missions. While chemical rockets are indispensable for escaping Earth's gravity, Fusion-based drives would excel in space environments, enabling missions to Mars or the outer planets. Despite their promise, these systems face daunting technical challenges, including the stabilization of plasma at fusion temperatures and the development of materials capable of withstanding such extremes. With organizations like SpaceX, Blue Origin, and NASA investing in next-generation propulsion, fusion-based plasma drives may soon transition from concept to reality. Pulse Plasma Fusion Systems – Bridging the Gap to address the challenges of sustained plasma fusion, pulse plasma systems offer a practical alternative. Unlike continuous fusion reactors, these systems operate in bursts, making them more manageable and less energy-intensive. Helicity Space, a pioneering company in this domain, has developed magnetic inertial fusion devices capable of producing thrust using terrarium and magnetic reconnection. This approach is similar to Z-pinch technology, but employs spherical tokamaks and shear flub to achieve plasma confinement. The advantage of pulse systems is their ability to stabilize plasma for short durations, avoiding the complexities of long-term stabilization. By using magnetic fields to momentarily hold plasma, these systems can generate significant thrust without the need for constant energy input. Prototypes are already under development with promising results indicating their potential for interplanetary missions. 
Additionally, Pulsar Fusion, another key player, claims to have developed systems capable of reaching plasma temperatures of 100 million degrees Celsius, translating into speeds of up to 500,000 miles per hour. If successful, these technologies could drastically change how we approach space exploration. Advantages and Applications of Plasma Propulsion Plasma propulsion systems offer numerous advantages that set them apart from traditional chemical rockets and jet engines. First, their high-specific impulse makes them incredibly fuel-efficient, particularly for long-duration missions. This efficiency is critical for reducing the costs and logistical challenges associated with carrying large amounts of fuel. Second, plasma propulsion systems are highly scalable, making them suitable for both small satellites and large spacecraft. For instance, NASA's ion thrusters, a precursor to advanced plasma systems, have been used successfully in missions like Dawn, which explore the asteroid belt. Third, plasma propulsion systems have minimal environmental impact as they can operate using renewable energy sources like solar power. While their current applications are limited to space environments, advancements in power density and thermal management could pave the way for their use in atmospheric flight. Moreover, plasma propulsion's adaptability makes it a promising candidate for multi-mission spacecraft combining versatility with efficiency. Experimental and Prototype Developments Prototypes of plasma propulsion systems are already making significant strides. One of the most notable examples is the Variable Specific Impulse Magnetoplasma rocket, which heats plasma to millions of degrees Celsius using radio waves. The VX200 variant, for instance, achieves temperatures of 4 million degrees Celsius, enabling speeds of up to 123,000 miles per hour. However, its reliance on power sources like solar panels limits its scalability for more ambitious missions. Another promising prototype comes from Helicity Space, which focuses on magnetic inertial fusion for pulse thrust. By achieving plasma confinement through advanced magnetic fields, Helicity systems could overcome the energy constraints of continuous fusion reactors. Pulsar Fusion, on the other hand, aims to combine electromagnetic confinement with advanced propulsion technologies, pushing the boundaries of speed and efficiency. These prototypes not only showcase the potential of plasma propulsion, but also highlight the importance of collaboration between private companies, governments, and research institutions in advancing this technology. Challenges and Future Outlook while plasma propulsion has immense potential, several critical challenges must be addressed before it becomes a mainstream technology. The most pressing issue is the development of power sources capable of sustaining high-energy plasma states. Solar panels, while efficient in low-power applications, fall short for the energy-intensive demands of fusion-based systems. Nuclear reactors, both fission and fusion, present viable alternatives but come with their own set of challenges, including safety concerns and public perception. Additionally, the materials used in plasma propulsion systems must withstand extreme temperatures and radiation levels. Advances in materials science, such as the development of ultra-high temperature ceramics and radiation-resistant alloys, will be crucial in overcoming these obstacles. Despite these challenges, the future of plasma propulsion remains bright. With continued investment and innovation, these systems could enable faster and more sustainable space travel, opening up new possibilities for exploration and colonization. Thank you for watching. If you found this video interesting and want to dive deeper into the world of groundbreaking aerospace technologies, be sure to hit that like button and share your thoughts in the comments below. Your engagement helps us bring you more fascinating content about the future of science and innovation. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you in the next video.